Have you ever wanted to do an Italian twist? I will be honest, I have no idea what an Italian twist is. That's why I'm here today with the beautiful Taylor Pattenbrink, who's gonna show us on our gorgeous model, Jennifer, <laughs> the Italian twist. twist. Ooh. It's a very elaborate ponytail that looks really great, and usually it looks very tricky. So first you wanna start off with four sections. As you can see, we did her middle section her crown area, and then the back. So we're gonna start in the back. I'm just gonna quickly put up the ponytail. So we've got Taylor's sure four smooth. sections. And the back section, Taylor, you're just doing a simple ponytail yes. back here? Yep. So we got that done. So a nice, tight, low ponytail with this back section. We're going to take the top down. Again, we're going to do some back combing. We're going to give Jennifer a little height back mm -hmm. there. What girl doesn't like some height? Right? The bump. Instant contouring and smoothing. <laughs> Our little beauty tricks. We love it. And you're only back combing a section of the hair. You're not going all the way down. The ends aren't going to be part of the bump, so therefore you don't want the back combing to go all the way to the ends because we want them to still be smooth and curled. Great tip. Oh, now Jennifer's got all that nice height back there. So you take all of it you get the height that you want. And Taylor's tricks with the bobby pin. She's got some tips for us that she told us earlier. Can you share those with the viewers? Of course. If you're ever getting the bobby pins not to stick, a good trick is to just spray them with your hairspray. Look at that. And that just makes them, Taylor, a little sticky, a little... Yep. It helps with the security of them. Remember, Taylor's tip is to spray those bobby pins and cross them so your hairstyle stays up and tight all night. It also helps so that you don't have to have so many pins. There's so many times that you go and you get your hair done and you have a bazillion pins in your hair and they just drive you crazy, they give you a headache, they make your hair heavy. It's a great way for that to be. Yeah, with Taylor's tips, that's not gonna happen. Oh, Taylor, that looks so pretty already. Now we're gonna take our sides back. This is where the twists come in. Oh. I'm, so you're taking, I'm going to see if I can do this with you. So we're going to twist it. So we're going to take the sides. And this is where the twist, you know what is so amazing, Taylor? Now that we're doing it, it's pretty darn easy. Yeah. That's the beauty of breaking it down to wow. understand where you're wanting to go with it all. Thank you. My side's not twisted as well as Taylor's. I can already tell that. Sorry, Jennifer. One side's going to definitely look better than the other. <laughs> you did great. It looks fantastic. <laughs> oh, I love this look. This is so classic. This reminds me of old school Hollywood glam. And we're going to give it a spray to keep it all... Taylor, you do this right to kind of smooth out Definitely. some of the loose hairs. Another good trick is to spray the back of your comb. Oh. And it smooths them out easily. Look at that. So from not even knowing what an Italian twist is to this beautiful style, Taylor, this is amazing. For this and other hair tutorials, come see Taylor and I at GoCurvy.com.